What is going on with NBC? I think this is a question that has kind of come up in recent months after the new TV deal was announced and some of the news around NBC was announced, but now it is a full-fledged above-the-surface question. Jim Utter reported on Twitter a bit earlier today, quote, The CW will begin its broadcast of the NASCAR Xfinity Series a year earlier than planned as it will now do the final eight races of the 2024 season, taking them over from NBC and USA Network. To me, this is big, big news for the future of NASCAR and what the broadcast partners are looking at when it comes to basically just how loyal they'll be and how much they'll stick behind them. Maybe this is a NASCAR move. I don't know. But there's a couple ways to look at this. One, like I just said, it could be a NASCAR move where they want to try and get ahead of the curve a year early, try and get people used to going to the CW, seeing how NBC is not going to be doing anything with the Xfinity series from 2025 and beyond. And I think that could be a positive way to look at it. I mean, before the 2001 TV deal, NBC actually did a cup race it wasn't initially scheduled to do. So that could be the case. It might not be a sky is falling kind of thing. But I'm a YouTuber, so why the hell would I not try and go down that path a little bit as well? NBC is seemingly kind of scaling back its NASCAR coverage, and its actions have been extremely weird to fans. This is the latest of them, but basically giving up eight, not high profile series races, but still a pretty higher level racing series races, I think are a really big deal, especially since most were on the USA network. And I'm wondering if NASCAR could make maybe a deal to have one or more races move from USA to NBC for the cup series. It would have to be some kind of deal made, I would think, and the contract did have them initially going through the end of this season. So it'll be interesting to see if there's any changes on the cup front. But NBC has been acting weird the last couple of months, and I think it's something we need to kind of look at in more totality here. NBC has one announced this and while the cw is paying 115 mil a year for the xfinity series starting next year it's still odd to see them start this a year early but the thing with nbc is that this is only the latest in issues or different ways they're changing first off dale earnhardt jr has left nbc and will not be back in 2024 this was probably the biggest asteroid to hit the earth when it came to NASCAR broadcasting news, at least up until this point. Dale Jr. has been pretty much the heart and soul of the NBC broadcasts since he came up into the booth in 2018. His slide job call is iconic now, and he has been basically the one who jump-started them after a slow start in their first three seasons from 2015 to 2017. Not having Dale Jr. in the booth, I think, will do a couple things. First off, I think it's going to bring NBC a lot more heat than it normally would get. NBC is not perfect. While it might be better than NASCAR and Fox, they still do have their own issues, but Dale Jr. masked a lot of them. One, because he's really popular and fans would not go against Redneck Jesus, but the other one is probably more because, well, now that Jr.'s shield is out of the way, they can basically just go ham on him, and they've made these decisions and come to these bad decisions in the eyes of the fans, like letting Dale Jr. walk, that are probably going to get them at least maybe the ire of the fans, if not just a little bit disgruntlement from them. And I think that that is going to be kind of the through line and the byline going into this season of NASCAR's coverage on NBC. And this isn't the only major, major change. NASCAR and NBC will have a new play-by-play -play announcer after the Olympic break. Yeah, they have Rick Allen, and he has been there since 2015, but the Brickyard will be his final race with the company. There's no news yet on where he's going. Some, like myself, have theorized he might be going to Amazon as well as Warner Discovery with Dale Earnhardt Jr., but that's all hearsay in the current moment. He could be going to CW to help with their Xfinity coverage and have the entire season to himself as the lead announcer for a series, similar to what he did for the NASCAR Craftsman Truck Series back in the day. 
It would be a seemingly downgrade, but he probably would actually get paid more in doing so. Lee Diffie is going to be his replacement, so if anything, it's a lateral move, more than likely actually a positive move for NBC, but it will be a culture change as, let's just face it, NASCAR fans have not exactly been the greatest with change, especially when it has to deal with an American getting replaced by someone who isn't at least seen as an American. That's the issue there, I think, and people aren't going to want to say it, but it is true. And it's very odd seeing all these moves from NBC on top of what we talked about before. NBC downsizes starting in 2025. They have the last 14 cup races, and most of which are on the USA Network. They don't have Xfinity. They still don't have truck. So instead of having like 30, 40, whatever it might be, total NASCAR races, they have 14. Now, hopefully that means they put more time, money, and effort into it and make their coverage better. That would be the positive way to look at it. But it is a noticeable trend downwards in the amount of NASCAR coverage that they'll be giving. And it has been seen before where NBC, after a while, if there's not as much of an ROI, or even if there is an ROI, but it's not the type they want to see, they tend to lose interest, like they did with NASCAR in 2005 and 2006, which is very odd because those are two of the most, as well as the most in 2005, viewed NASCAR seasons ever. So it's going to be something else to watch. And I don't think the dominoes are done falling either. I think they're only just beginning. This new TV deal is huge, not only for the streaming part, not only for bringing back Turner, not only for this kind of news, but the fact that you're going to see probably the biggest media free agency period since NASCAR probably has ever covered it. It's the biggest that I think I could ever think of. Dale Earnhardt Jr., again, the first big domino to fall, but now NBC doing these moves, Rick Allen being out of the booth. I think we're going to see even more, and I think that next year, you're going to see a NASCAR coverage landscape that you do not recognize from the current day or anything before it. It might sound drastic, it might sound weird, it might sound scary, but it's coming, and you guys just got to be prepared for it. So with that, I'm going to pass this all on to you. What do you think of the fact that the CW will be covering the last eight races of the Xfinity Series season instead of NBC and USA? And what do you think of NBC's move so far? Are you a fan? Not a fan? Are you worried? Let me know down in the comments below. While you're at it, leave a like on this video, share this video, and subscribe to this channel for more great and fun NASCAR content. Thank you so much to all my channel members for your continued support, and until next time, have a good one.